Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So I wanted to share with you all how you can easily intermittent fast a lot longer every single day. And I am sharing what I have learned from my own personal experience with intermittent fasting over the last year. And for the majority of that time, I've been doing two meals a day with the intermittent fasting method known as the 16-8 method, where you fast for around 16 hours and eat for around an eight hour window. But what I say is for the majority of that time, I've actually been fasting around 20 hours a day. But now I've been eating one meal a day for around a week or so and really, really enjoying it. And I've experimented with it in the past and it's working really, really well for me in comparison to when I've tried it in the past. And how I've managed to make it a lot more easily sustainable long term whilst having an abundance of energy during my fasting state and having optimal cognitive function just feeling the best overall and not having insane cravings for food is very very simple all it comes down to is eating enough calories when you eat your meal because there's a lot of people in the intermittent fasting and one meal a day movement promoting severe calorie restriction or moderate calorie restriction and this is something that I do not promote on this channel at all or in my everyday life to anyone that I recommend intermittent fasting or one meal a day to because yeah what I found from my own experience when I calorie restrict my energy levels go down my mood is not as good and I just don't feel as good all round throughout the day and I get more intense cravings and I find that I have to break my fast a lot earlier so when I eat I do not count my calories at all and I eat like an absolute warrior and for my one meal a day I eat around 3,000 calories for my one meal in a day so as you see there's a lot of calories and that is what most people will eat within a whole day so I am basically eating what people normally would within a day but all within one meal so as you can see I am not calorie restricting at all and I'm a very busy person as an entrepreneur with many different businesses and I'm coaching many people on a regular basis and I'm also a calisthenics athlete and just very proactive in my everyday life so I need to be having an abundance of energy throughout the day and also having my mind work to the best of its ability as well especially with focus memory alertness and also just being able to sustain my attention on tasks that I am doing. So yeah, if you want to start fasting a lot longer, start eating as many calories as you can. Don't count your calories and have unlimited amount of calories within the meal that you're having. Whether you're doing one meal a day or two meals a day with the 16-8 intermittent fasting method or something similar to this. And if you're someone that would like to see what I have eaten in a day when doing the 16-8 intermittent fasting method. I'm going to put a link for a video here and I show you fully what I eat within a day on a whole foods plant-based vegan diet. And then shortly after I put another link here for a video where I show you what I eat when I am doing one meal a day, which I'm currently on that journey and if you're not used to eating a lot of food when you start to do one meal a day or intermittent fasting on a regular basis like myself because i do it every single day then all you need to do is slowly start increasing the amount of food that you're eating per meal and train your body to be able to handle eating a lot more food and that's all i've done over time and it's worked very effectively for me and other people some people can just go straight into eating loads of food but then there's a lot of people that cannot and it's the same when you get into running for example you don't just start running marathons you slowly build up to a marathon over time and this is very similar with increasing the amount of food that you're eating so slow and steady wins the race and a lot of people may be concerned well wow, that's so many calories it's gonna make me gain body fat and I'm not gonna get the ultimate weight loss benefits that I'm looking to gain. But I can tell you right now, it keeps me super, super lean, as I'll show you now. So as you can see, I have very, very low body fat percentage, very visible six pack, the type of body that they call in the bodybuilding movement, a ripped or shredded body. 
So yeah, and my body fat percentage is around 8%. So yeah, I have no issues with keeping a low body fat percentage. And I've seen so many people that eat this way long term as well with an abundance of calories, such as Blake 101. He doesn't eat a vegan plant-based diet, but yeah, he does one meal a day and eats around 3,000 to 4,000 calories per meal. And he has an absolutely amazing body with great muscle development and a relatively low body fat percentage at the same time. So you do not need to be concerned at all. And the longer you fast, the longer period of time your body is in a fat burning state where it's burning its own body fat as fuel. And also whilst that's going on, insulin is low and insulin is a fat storage hormone and it improves insulin sensitivity. So when you eat, foods that raise your insulin levels when you come out of a fasted state, insulin's not gonna skyrocket nowhere near as high in comparison to if you was not fasting as long. And it has been shown through scientific research, the longer you fast for, the greater insulin sensitivity benefits you get and the lower that your insulin goes. And the last two things as well is human growth hormone goes up even higher when fasting longer and testosterone as well. And these two things are also key for burning body fat and lowering your body fat percentage whilst also increasing your muscle mass and preserving muscle mass at the same time. So as you can see, there's a lot of things working synergistically alongside each other to help you lose some serious body fat percentage if you're looking to do that whilst increasing your muscle mass at the same time. And what I would say is you don't need to eat a whole foods plant-based vegan diet. I do recommend it to people because I believe that it gives people one of the greatest state of health in mind and body and it's a diet that we're very naturally designed for. But as you'll see with Blake 101, he eats all types of different what I would call garbage refined processed foods and he still has an absolutely an amazing physique. But yeah, I wouldn't necessarily recommend going and eating what he's eating. Try and eat more natural plant-based foods and whole foods because yeah they're just going to give you the best state of health because if someone has an amazing body it doesn't necessarily mean they have the greatest state of health and it's not necessarily going to maximize their longevity as well and for me i want to live as long as possible and have the greatest state of health possible and be free of sickness and disease my whole life but this is really amazing that you can just do intermittent fasting or one meal a day and not even have to change your diet if you don't want to and you can do all different types of diets and people still seem to get the same benefits for reducing their body fat percentage massively and helping them go in the direction of achieving the dream body that they want and actually keeping it long term as long as they stick to intermittent fasting on a regular basis or one meal a day so yeah that is it for this video if you have any questions leave them down below as always i love answering your questions and if you have any specific types of videos you'd like me to make then let me know down below and i'll make them for you as soon as possible and if you like the video like it down below give us a thumbs up and please share this video with anyone that you think would like to hear about what i've shared with you today in this video in relation to intermittent fasting and how to actually fast longer and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis talking about intermittent fasting one meal a day calisthenics also sharing calisthenics workouts with you and many other different videos help you increase your energy levels to have an abundance of energy throughout the day also help you achieve the body that you desire and your fitness goals as well so if those type of videos sound good to you make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below and you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button otherwise youtube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded and i have new ones coming every single day so as always stay strong stay energetic and go and get those gains peace